Get out here and hustle and campaign and raise money and look for investors. Get a fucking second job. Get a fucking third job. What's good, family? It's your boy, D-Boy. So a lot of people been hitting me up about this whole business loan thing. And I need credit so I can take out a loan, start my business, and things of this nature, man. I want to say this, man. There are so many other things that you can do before you decide to go and take out a business loan, bro. There are so many things you can do, bro. And I think the problem with most people is they either lack patience or they have too much pride you know what i'm saying so many people will try to play all these games and do all these gimmicks to raise their credit score so they can go get a loan and be real with y'all most y'all not even gonna get a loan from the bank bro let's just let's just start there most of you aren't even gonna get a loan from the bank and if you do it's gonna be very small let's just be realistic but more so bro why can't you just get a second job why can't you just get a third job and, and keep working and save your money and stack your money and grow your business that way why can't you raise money you know what i'm saying some of y'all come from big families big fucking families why can't you reach out to every single one of your family members and ask for 20 bucks 50 bucks 100 bucks and let them know that you're trying to start this business this is what you can do this is what you know provide your market research show them why your business is going to be successful you know what i'm saying why can't you do that? Why can't you ask your friends? Why can't you go on social media and campaign and fucking campaign and get people to give you money to invest in you, get people to believe in you? Why can't you do that? Y'all got too much pride. Companies, these companies that y'all idolize, or these people y'all idolize, they have raised so much money you don't even realize. Companies throw fundraising events all the time to raise money. People take donations all the time to get out of situations. Why can't you start your own campaign and raise money for your business? Why can't you find a partner who has the capital to invest in you? You're the machine. They have the capital. Start a partnership. You don't have to go to the bank and go into debt, get interest cracked all the time to start a business bro we need to change our mindsets i think too many people are looking for the easy way out which is oh i'm just gonna take out a loan bro that is just so reckless to me because when you take out a business loan if you're getting started you don't have any traction you don't you don't know when your next customer is going to come or maybe you don't even have enough customers or clientele yet but one thing for sure the bank wants their money every single month. Every single month, the bank wants their money. You do realize that, right? They don't care that you had COVID-19. They don't care that somebody passed away. They don't care that you've been in an accident. They don't care about none of that. They want that money that you owe. You do realize that, right? Why would you want to go into business with somebody who does not care about you? You know what I'm saying? People try to idolize people because you think they got money because they got a store. They got a storefront. That don't mean they got money. That don't mean their business is profitable. You don't actually know these people's financials. Just because you see somebody open up a business, that does not mean they have money. We have to change our mindset here, bro. Some of you are so intelligent and you're too smart to sit around trying to look for the easy way out bro get out here and hustle and campaign and raise money and look for investors get a fucking second job get a fucking third job